I recently saw this movie called Rescue Dawn, which is based on the true story of Dieter Dengler, who was one of the uh, guys to escape from a Viet Cong prison camp in the jungle. And it's the story of how he gets back. And when he arrives back, because he's escaped, the, uh, the government want to keep him in isolation. So these agents appear and they whisk him off and they stick him in a hospital so he can recover, but also so they can pump him for information. Now what his mates do is they secretly plan to kidnap him from the government. So they arrive with a big birthday cake and a trolley sitting on a trolley with a, that's covered with a white sheet. And they persuade the agents to leave the guy alone for a few seconds so they can have a chat with him. What they don't realise is what they do is they hide him inside the trolley under the sheet. They whisk him out of the hospital, take him off in a helicopter and fly him back to the aircraft carrier where everyone's waiting for him to throw a massive party to say, welcome home Dieter, we missed you and we love you. Now, in the Bible, there are four biographies about Jesus, Matthew, Mark, Luke and John. And in all of them, Jesus gets into trouble because he spends a lot of time at parties. He's always hanging out with people who are having a great time. And one day when someone says to him, all right, tell us what heaven is like. Tell us what God's kingdom is going to be like. He says it's going to be like a party. And I guess it's going to be like what Dieter Dengler discovered, that everyone is waiting to celebrate and actually give them a good time. Now, religion is never thought of in that way, is it? It's always thought about rules and regulations and being serious and getting it right. And Jesus, all his life, is modelling something very different. He's saying, actually, the kingdom of God is about making people feel better, not worse. It's about welcoming people. It's about celebrating their lives and saying, you're brilliant. God thinks you're great. And uh, we want to show you that.